Tonight, UW-Madison's Board of Regents pushing back. A unanimous decision Monday naming Dr. Jennifer Manukin the university's new chancellor. I will say that I'm a strong supporter of free speech in universities. I think it's very important for all ideas to be able to be uh, engaged with. Manukin, dean of the UCLA Law School, answering questions Tuesday from Los Angeles, just hours after Republican leaders called the decision ridiculous and blatantly partisan. When the first thing that we see is they pick a far left radical from California, who I'm sure has California values, uh, that is something that's going to have a very hard time in the uh, Wisconsin state capitol. Some Republicans who control the state legislature now even threatening future increases in state funding, questioning Manukin's views on hot button issues like critical race theory, free speech and vaccine mandates. I'm looking forward to getting to know everybody. I'm a, I, I, I'm a connector. I'm willing to sit in the room. I'm willing to listen. The Board of Regents tonight, which still includes five appointees from former Governor Scott Walker, fully backing its unanimous decision. When we hire based on leadership qualities, um, we don't have a political litmus test. I think the proof is in the pudding. For example, we hired the state's longest serving GOP governor to run this system. Manukin will leave UCLA this summer and begin her new post here on campus in August. In Madison, I'm Matt Smith, WISN 12 News. For his part, Governor Evers praised Monday's decision. The governor's appointees have yet to be confirmed by the state Senate, leaving open the possibility they could be replaced if a Republican wins this fall.